YouTube, Willie Man here. We are now going to be showing you a demo of the 2020.40.8 autopilot software, navigate on autopilot full self-driving. So let's just go ahead and get started. Let's get a destination going. Navigate to JD Flannels. We've got autopilot Engage, navigate on autopilot started, and the navigation is in route, and we are on our way. So, it's taken the street numerous times, and feels a little bit smoother on the lane centering, a little less lane within the within the lane bouncing. We've got a green light come out up here. Just tap the accelerator. Beautiful, no clouds in the sky today. You can see the ocean perfectly. Okay. Let's see, so sometimes this lane splits right here into two. And thankfully it chose the inside lane. Still got a green light. <clears throat> this is crucial because last time I was in the lane to my left, uh, entering the freeway, the Tesla just blew right past the entrance. So let's see how it handles this. Okay, that was uh, a little unnerving, but it did it. Slammed on the brakes the last minute as it dove into that corner. And, oof, that'll wake you up in the morning. Okay, so we're approaching the carpool lane. Is it going to stop? It just went right through that red light. Didn't even care. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's see. I'm going to step on the accelerator, give us some action here. I'll have to take a look at the footage and see what the uh, this screen was showing when that traffic light came. Okay, so let's up it to 75. A little bit of bounciness. Uh, anytime the lane goes from two to one, there seems to be a little bit of back and forth bouncing in between the lane as it tries to decide where center is. Hopefully that'll get smoothed out with the uh, FSD launch, full, full FSD launch feature complete later this year. Fingers crossed anyway. We all know Elon time. Okay, so we're just cruising in the slow lane. The vehicle has initiated the turn signal to get over. Beautiful Southern California morning today. 7.45 a.m. We've got a high of 73 today. It's currently about 57 degrees. As we navigate on our way to JD Flannels Donuts. Best Donuts in Orange County, by far. If you've been to JD Flannels and you like it, go ahead and give a thumbs up or comment down below what's your favorite donut. So cruising right along here, we are now in the middle lane Heading 75 miles an hour down the highway. I do have carpool mode enabled, but because the flow of traffic is exceeding our speed, I, d I believe we're not actually utilizing it. I don't know if that's exactly why we're not utilizing it, but that's what I think is happening. So we're approaching some vehicles. You can see the Tesla is picking up the vehicles in the center display. Ooh. Zoom out here. So, so far, hands free FSD is working beautifully, except for a few of those hiccups earlier. We talked about running the red light at the on ramp and some lane bouncing, some lane centering bouncing. We 
are currently 2.4 miles from our destination. About five minutes left. Vehicle's getting over. And we are set to exit the highway in 1.2 miles. And there you go. The Tesla has initiated the turn signal. It has changed lanes. We are now approximately half a mile from our destination. Vehicles on the right. We will need to exit, I believe, or I can get over one more lane. And there it goes. Tesla, Tesla initiated the turn signal. This is self-driving at its finest. Again, this is not even the FSD beta, which I guess was really more geared towards city streets. Which makes sense because the current iteration of FSD Navigate on Autopilot works pretty flawlessly on the highway, except for the few minor exceptions you saw earlier. So we've now exited the highway. Let's see if it'll choose the correct lane. Keep us in the left lane because it knows we need to turn left up here. So far so good. Okay, it has now indicated, sorry, it has now ended navigate on autopilot. And we are now stopped at the red light. So last time I checked, Tesla was not able to make this turn. We'll try again just to see if anything's changed, even though there's been no software updates since the last time I tested this. And make the turn, and is it just gonna go straight? Okay, that was not good. So I had to take over there, turn the wheel. Again, that's not what it's supposed to do. I mean, it did what it's programmed to do, because currently, City street driving is not allowed or enabled for this version. So it kind of uh, walked up to that stop sign a little bit, stopped, or stopped red light, stopped a little bit further back and then inched forward and stopped and inched forward. So that was, that was interesting. You can see what's being picked up on the screen here as these vehicles pass by. Still not seeing that sim. Oh, there it is. Okay. So, so this is FSD current iteration on city streets. Managing the stoplight, going through the stoplight. So I've got to initiate a turn here. Okay, and we made it. JD Flannels, everybody. So they have a brown butter cake donut, which is absolutely divine. And it's basically a cake donut with a brown butter baked into it with a brown, brown butter vanilla glaze, I believe. And it's pretty spectacular. They also have an amazing old fashioned. But there it is, JD Flannels. We made it, everyone. Well, as always, thanks for watching. I appreciate uh, you taking this trip with me. And I hope you all have a wonderful, safe uh, day. Have a happy Halloween, everyone. And thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. And hit that notifications button so you can see more videos when I release them. Take care, everyone. Have a good day.